patterns can be used in Photoshop layers and via the layer style dialog. Now I'm just going to go to, got a document open, so I'm just going to go to layer, new layer, click OK. I'm going to fill it, I'm just going to fill the black, click OK. Then go to layer, layer style, and they will see pattern overlay. Now you can use patterns, so some graphic extra dot com patterns. I'm just going to quickly show you, but you can use PAT files you can find on the web to actually load the patterns. Just quickly go over to the right side of the menu and go to replace patterns. I'm just going to quickly go up to select a color design. Select pattern. So you just go through the patterns, decide which pattern you want to use. Say that one. You can scale the pattern. At the same time, you can position the pattern, change the opacity, so you can see more of the previous layer, as well as changing the blend mode. Now, if I'd actually use, just going to click there, I can actually resize that. Just going to, and then go to the layer style again and I'm going to just go bevel and boss you can actually see it embossed so you can create sort of a button design very easily with uh, the pattern as well again go and select a different pattern at this point so you can just see it can still be modified at this point also you can still drag it so if you want say a certain point to be central to the uh, design also you can use them in the texture option so bevel emboss texture so you can actually then go to to that and then they're, obviously they're grayscale so you will see them you won't see the color there but you can change the scale again to match you wish or you can change it to slightly different and move it again also you can change the depth so it's not so extreme so make it sub more subtle texture click ok at that point so they're very easy to use Patterns can be used in layer styles.